If you're a blogger or publisher just like me, you're probably checking your Google Analytics stats every day. I know that I am. And sometimes when we get in there, we're not seeing what we want to see. Sometimes we see a dip in traffic. And before you rush out in the crazy panic attack, let's take a quick look at what might have happened because it might not be a Google penalty. Many times it's something else. And let's start by looking at how you can know if it's a Google penalty or not. So if we are dealing with a Google penalty, it can be one of two options. Number one will be what we call a manual penalty from Google. You can check this inside Google Search Console. Let me show you here on my computer screen exactly how you do that. So right here you can see if there's any manual actions taken from Google's site on your website. There's probably not because these are really rare. So the other option here is that you've been affected by one of the many Google updates to the algorithm. The way to check if you've been hit by one of these updates is to check the exact date where you saw the dip in traffic and compare them to when these Google algorithm updates were pushed by Google. You can find these days and numbers on pages like Search Engine Land, Search Engine Journal or Moz.com. If you just search on Google for Google algorithm updates, you will definitely find these websites at the top and they will show you the exact dates. So you just match them to the dip you saw in Google Analytics to see if that could be what happened. And if the date doesn't match with your dip in traffic, there's probably something else going on. And let's take a quick look at what that might be. So one of the most typical things to see is that one of your best ranking articles maybe got outranked by a competitor. Many times our websites will have just a few articles that together accounts for maybe 30 to 50% of the total traffic to our websites. So if one of these articles are taking a dip in the Google results, you will quickly see a dip in the overall traffic numbers to your website. So we need to figure out if that's what happened. Let me show you how to do that inside Google Analytics. So first I want you to check the last seven days. And now you want to compare this week to a week before you saw the dip in traffic. So let's say this one was a 50% dip. Then you need to check this article here and see if you got outranked. Maybe you move from the top position to position number three or four or five. And then you need to look into how you can improve your content in order to get back on that top position. Another common reason why you might see a sudden dip in traffic can be due to seasonality. Maybe your website is covering topics around summer activities. Maybe you're writing about water sports or hiking or something like that. In that case, you will always see a dip during the first couple of weeks when the weather starts turning. And of course, it can also be the other way around. Maybe you're covering topics that are more popular in the winter time. Maybe your website is about skiing or just something that's more popular during the cold season. So as soon as we see some warm weather, the traffic will go down. It might also be that you're writing about something that's trending for a while. Maybe you're writing about politics, news, celebrities or something like that. And these things go up and down all the time. Something happens in the media and everybody wants to read about that. So you might have more ups and downs in your general traffic if you're writing on such topics. And the last thing I want you to check is Google Trends. It might just be that the thing you're writing about is slowly dying or maybe it's just not as trendy right now as it used to be. Let's take a look at two examples inside Google Trends. Follow me here to my screen. The first example here is a crazy example. It's the fidget spinners. As you probably know, these were crazy popular for a very short time. So if you created a website about these things, you will definitely have seen a dip all of a sudden. Let's take a look at something that's a little more normal. With a search like long beard, it will come in and out of fashion and style. So some celebrity like, let's say Brad Pitt, for example, could show up on the red carpet with all his beard shaved off. Now people might not be that interested in having long beards anymore. And maybe the trend is starting to shift. But as you can imagine, this is not something that will cause a sudden dip in traffic. This is more something that will cause your traffic to decrease over time, maybe a month, maybe two, maybe a season. As you can see, there can be many different reasons why your traffic is going up and down. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you want more tips like this and leave me a like or a comment if you like this video.